Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Okay, my name is Ahmad Azri bin Ahmad Wazi. Uh, EA17073. Okay, for the project assignment, uh, I am done uh, what I'm doing, uh, pedestrian traffic light. Okay, for the inter introduction, pedestrian signals are special type of traffic signals indication installed for the exclusive purpose of controlling pedestrian traffic. They are frequently installed at signal, signalized intersection where engineering analyze, analysis shows that the vehicular signals cannot adequate, adequately accommodate the pedestrians using the intersection. Pedestrian signals have evolved over the years uh, and are now effective sophisticated traffic controls. Okay, for the problem statement, Pedestrians often have a difficult time crossing roadways with high speed traffic, particularly when on wide streets. Even when pedestrians use marked crosswalks, they, they may not be able to find sufficient gaps in traffic or may be hesitate to risk crossing in a short gap because many motorists do not use as required by law. Increasing pedestrians' feelings of comfort and safety while crossing the streets. Some pedestrian signals integrate a countdown timer showing how many seconds are remaining for the clearing phase. Okay, for the objectives, uh, to design pedestrian traffic light with using STM32 F103, 7 segment, uh, 16 times to LCD display and push button. Okay, the methodology. This pedestrian traffic light project is developed in Proteus 8 Professional and Kill Vision 5. Uh, then, uh, push button is used in the project to present detectors intended to provide pedestrians with the ability to activate a pedestrian signal and reassure pedestrians uh, that they will receive a crossing indication. And then, uh, seven segment BCD was used to display the countdown timer for pedestrians. Six semi LCD display are used to act like a traffic light movement for a car. GBIO and GPIOB are used as the output ports for the LED. So for segment BCD and push button. Okay, the flow of the pedestrian traffic light. The LCD will show drive safe while the seven segment display zero. When the push button has been pushed, the LCD will show slow and the seven segment will, uh, will count down uh, from zero to nine. Uh, and from nine, from nine to zero, and from zero to nine. Display zero to display oh, from nine to zero. Then the LCD will change and show stop, and then the seven segment will count down from nine seconds to zero second. The process will look. Okay, this is the component. The user is the 10k ohm. Okay, this is how the first chart. You see display drive, drive save, seven segment display zero. Uh, if no, it will go back at the start. If yes. We, the push button press is push button press it will the cd will show slow at the seven segment if no it will go at the start again then cd display stop if yes then decrease the counter counter if yes it will go to go to start again if no the counter is equal to negative one and it will end this is the block diagram this is the coding for this project And this is the schematic diagram. The SED, uh, the SED will show drive safe while the seven segment display zero. So when the push button is uh, clicked, the SED signal will show the countdown from nine to zero. Uh, the SED signal will change and show stop and the seven segment countdown from nine to two second, two zero second. Okay, so for the conclusion, in the conclusion, this pedestrian traffic light helps pedestrians cross a road or intersection with traffic light. This project has been developed by using ARM Portal M3 STM32 F103 microcontroller. Besides, we can improve this project with adding the buzzer when the countdown was counted, which will also indicate the time that's safe for the system to cross. Okay, that's all for me. Thank you.